On defense, number three, Will Borgen. The stay-at-home beast. He obviously is a great skater, really plays with a puck. He's got that internal push and drive that's unspoken. Everyone loves him. He's easy to get along with. I like to just do my job and not let the other team score. Intriguing and limitless. Kept in the right point by Borgen. Long shot, they score! Shot for the right point by Borgen. Intriguing that expectations were high, but maybe not to the point where he's exhibited the progress that he's made. Nonetheless, he probably won't turn into to Bobby Orr or Eric Carlson, but I think the potential he could be a guy that changes what we projected for him. I see the same things here that I did in St. Cloud. St. Cloud State was the first place that offered me a scholarship to play college hockey. It was three of the best years of my life. I had a ton of fun there. He likes to keep it light and stuff in the room, which is good. I think that's important. You see a lot of guys before games that will focus really hard on what they need to do, and Borgen's complete opposite. He likes to you know, play sewer ball, you rip on the guys a little bit. Some teams have. More guys like me, some teams don't. There's a lot of skilled defensemen out there. I mean, I'm not going to say I'm a skilled defenseman, but I'm, I'm just a puck moving defenseman. There's physical guys. We have all, we have physical guys on our team, like McWilliam. We kind of complement each other with kind of how we play. It's kind of a simple game. Just simple things like always making yourself big, like shot blocking, the way he communicates on the ice constantly, even on the bench and stuff. What a great penalty kill by Borg and McWilliam on defense. Maybe I talk too much on the ice, but the more he feels comfortable, he, he's opened up. I think off there, that's not an issue. He's a really social guy. He's really come out of the shell, and he's a guy that uh, I think certainly his teammates gravitate to, and he's not a guy that talks about himself a whole lot. There's a lot of little things I've learned this year already with Coach Deneen. I think he's an efficient guy on both sides of the puck. On the defensive side, He's really learned the game quickly as far as his gaps and reading when to pressure and when to be smart and take away the best ice. And with the puck, he's really evolved in the way that he knows that he can skate with the puck. I hate practicing with Borgs. You have to just always you know, keep an eye on him, see where he's at, because he's going to come after you. He's going to challenge you. He's going to push you to make you a better hockey player. You can see his resume has been opened up a lot more and, and the things that he can offer. He's just a tough, gritty guy that will sell out for the team and do anything he can to, to help the boys win. My goal, and the puck just popped out and no one was in the lane for once. I mean, usually when you get it like near the blue line, there's guys blocking and in the way I just got lucky as coming off the bench, got a just free lane down to the top of the circles and shot it, <laughs> got lucky. He's stronger than what he was in college and he's only gonna get better and more time, hopefully he'll be up in Buffalo.